Today, we're going to look at one of the weirdest railroad scams. This is Railroad Showcase. Okay, so the third and final scam here is not as big, but it's probably the weirdest one that I've heard about railroading. So, in 1890, the Holman Speeding Truck Company appeared, claiming that they had developed a new technology that would allow for steam engines to increase speed using the same amount of steam and, by effect, using less fuel. They had two engines run with this design, one just being lifted up and the other one specially built by Baldwin Locomotive Works. Uh, from the book Development of the Locomotive Engine, Angus Sinclair said, they are advertising in Philadelphia papers that a company has been formed to sell this kind of locomotive, the capital stock being $10 million. They offer to sell the stock for $25 a share, the par value being $100. They make the claim that this sort of engine is destined to be the locomotive of the future. Sinclair went on to say, My opinion expressed in locomotive engineering was, It is a humbug. It is sound engineering to hold that every piece added to a machine after it has reached the practical stage is a source of weakness. A triple set of wheels under a locomotive would be proposed only by one who is densely ignorant of mechanics. They ran a few trips with it, mainly to keep selling stock, which worked, unfortunately, uh, because it seems that there was quite a few people who actually bought into this, most of them being people with a... With a small savings that they had set aside and they hoped that this might be the big break for them to be able to make more uh, so they they swindled old ladies out of their out of their savings that's the that's the tragedy about these scams i mean we look at it now and we see well obviously this thing is preposterous it won't work and and yet the people that they target are uh, the naive, the gullible, uh, the people who are desperately risking everything they have for the hope of something better, and and then guys like this come along. Yeah. The only silver lining to it is uh, because of the fact that it didn't work in any way, all it did was add more wear and tear, more maintenance, and it actually hindered the efficiency of the engine because it didn't actually change the way it ran. It just made it go through more gears to do it. Uh, it. It caused it to use more fuel and it derailed easier. So it ended fairly quickly and it gave us some pretty funny pictures to look at. So this was just a short clip of the full segment. You guys know the drill. Go to our website, rrshowcase.com to get access to the full episode. Check it out. And if you're on YouTube, you know that you can also find us on Facebook. The group is called Railroad Showcase RPO. And if you found us on Facebook, well, jump over to YouTube. You can find us there, too. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share. It really helps us out. Thanks again for watching.